people, Zarth Womp here, and welcome to episode 11 of Dagonrop Alter Despair Girls. Last time, we ran into Jotaro and learned that he's even more demented than we thought. I mean, he has marionettes of corpses. Those probably weren't corpses they got after this Toa City attack. He probably had those in his closet somewhere. But anyways, let's just go through this pay area. And just get away from this creepy subway station. Are you sure we can get out that way? Um, I don't know. Th th then why are you going that way? Let's just go back the way we came. What is it with you and being against this area, Toko? Did did ticket dispensers, did these pay areas take kill your family? Okay, but let's just get going. Let's just go back up here, up the stairs, to the city above. Okay, what's happening out here? Some execution? The Monokuma Shuffle! It, it, all lives are complete. It's in the games now. Yeah, get down with your funky selves, Monokumas! There's way too many of them. The Despair Boogaloo. Wait, don't you want to join the Despair Boogaloo? There's too many of them. It's too dangerous to go that way. Then what should we do? Don't ask me. I'm not your personal GPS. Well, you're the one telling me that I can't go certain directions, Toko. S sorry, you're just so reliable I thought I'd ask. Kamaru, you're sad if you think Toko's reliable. Why do you think she's not a full-fledged member of the, of the Future Foundation? If she was reliable, she would be. She'd be wearing a suit. Reliable? Whoa. Well, it is true that my brain is far superior to yours. Yes, that's the ultimate way to appease Togo, to stroke her ego. Now, let's see. It might be better to head back underground for now, to find another exit. Back through the underground? Are you sure you're okay with that? What do you mean? I mean, you're afraid of the dark, aren't you? The underground is pretty dark. Shit! Oh! Are you trying to be an example? To show me how to go forward, even if you're scared? No, Togo probably just forgot that it was dark. I see. As expected of a true mentor. Uh. Yes, the Toko mentoring experience. Next, she'll give you your, pair, your first pair of scissors that you can use to kill someone you like. A guy you like. Come on, let's just move, move, move. A Monokuma child, yay! <laughs> knockback! Oh, the shotgun ammo! It's tutorial time! Looks like you have obtained Knockback! As you might guess, Knockback can knock back Monokumas! It's short range and doesn't do damage, but its effect more than makes up for that. Like removing the shields of the guard Monokumas! Or knocking back a bomber Monokuma to make himself destruct where he lands! Oh, that's really useful! And if you use it right, this truth bullet can have some really powerful effects. Use it, over, use it on the various Monokumas to learn more about its effects firsthand. <laughs> yeah! Is that a new kind of bullet? This looks pretty useful. But this gun belongs to Future Foundation, right? So why are the kids giving me bullets? Because Nagito took your bullets away! I, I, I guess maybe there might be some kids in the group who want to support us. Huh? Support that us? That or maybe Nagito controls some of them. But who cares about that right now? Let's just look for the exit. I mean, it wouldn't be that much of a, of a stretch considering he is an ultimate despair. Y yeah. Because like I said before, I wouldn't be surprised if Kazuichi has some role in designing some of this stuff. Okay, but let's see if we can install some truth bolts. Actually, you know what? I'll also put that electric up, you know? Give Toko a skill, apparently. Okay, I'll put a bullet shot. Largely. Okay, I'll put largely. Let's see if we can do something. Okay, shot. Adorably. Let's see. Good. 
Okay. Let's just... Okay. Let's see if that works. Apparently I don't have anything, so might as well do something like that. Yeah, you know, I'll keep it like that, you know. Just be on the safe side. But anyways, we got knocked back. Let's head back here. It's that shield guy again. Counter it with the new ammo. With pleasure. You for me. Uh, sorry, wrong oh, thing. Wrong yeah. thing. Okay, knock back. Knock back. Yeah, knock you back. Knock you all back. Now break you. Yeah, combo, combo, combo breaker. That shield is so sturdy. Is it Gelalumen? It's Duralumen. Okay. Oh my gosh, they were designed by the ultimate imposter. And the next thing you know, they're going to be wearing night, go night vision goggles. <laughs> this is just too much. Out of the question. This creepiness is just out of the question. Isn't it just going to get darker if we keep going? Is it really going to be okay? It's... Probably gonna be fine. No, oh, you suck at cheering people up. Can't you choose your words more wisely? Coming from you, Miss Extracurricular Activities? Well, I'm sure you're just laughing at me in your head, thinking I'm just some scared little girl. I'm not laughing about it. I don't like dark places either. But honestly, for some reason, I feel at ease. Why do you feel at ease? You enjoy taking pleasure in other people's suffering? My suffering tastes delicious and you're planning on a four-course meal, huh? <laughs> you sure have a bitchy personality. You're the type to talk trash at a wedding, aren't you? No, Togo! No one could surprise you in that category. I, I didn't mean it like that. I just mean that I'm sure you're working hard, too. Of course. Even I'm at my limit. I'm scared of blood and the dark, and I'm just so tired, but... There's no choice but to do it. I'm not some crybaby, whiny, airheaded girl. I I'm not Hina! Whiny, crybaby? What? <laughs> yeah! Yeah! What? What was that? S sorry. I tried to scare you, but then your reaction scared me. Bravo, Kamaru! My slow clap! You didn't hear it in quite some time, but it's back! Huh? You really are an idiot! I was just trying to ease the tension a little. By creating more tension! Yeah, well, now I'm more afraid of your stupidity than the dark. Oh, sorry. Okay, let's just see what else is here. Okay, let's just scan to see if there's any more hidden children. Making a shopping district underground like this? What was the administration thinking? Hey, it's classy! Maybe it's subtle political satire? It's classy? What are you talking about? Okay. Well, they're being a sick. So, people with a sick. Examine. Let's see some more cutscenes. Um... The children playing with the bodies, they're different than the ones who give us items. They look the same, but something's definitely different about them. Well... They're just like adults. Some are good, some are bad. Don't waste time thinking about it. Then don't you think the ones who help us know it's wrong to kill adults? But now that you mention it, didn't you tell me before that they seem to be under orders? And didn't I tell you it's a waste of time thinking about brats who've g gone insane? If you have any energy to think, think about nonsense like that, use it for picking up your pace. Sorry. Well, sorry, I can't help but wonder about it. Okay, let's just search around. Well, like I said, maybe Nagito has some control over the, over the ones who give us items. To help balance the game out. Where 
are these Monokumas coming from? Right. Oh. Okay, let's do this. Let's pick up these coins. 150 right there. Okay, there's the stairway. I'm just gonna go and search around here. Oh, item. Children's Paradise Commandments 2. 1. Wash hands before a meal. Play video games no longer than 8 hours daily. If you ever feel like you are showing signs of reincarnating into a demon, take responsibility and end your own life. Anyone who breaks the rules will suffer the punishment. Hold in their poo all day after a big barbecue. Oh my gosh, these children are evil! Oh my gosh, good thing Nekumar was not seeing those commandments, otherwise he'd just go crazy. But then again, like I said, he's an ultimate despair, so he probably would love that. Holding the poo would be the ultimate despair for him. Toko, I think we can get out from those stairs. Y you're right. But let's head over there. Well, we can't. Giant gap. But anyways, let's just get going. Move. Dance, I'm sorry. Yes, move. Knock back. Joy. There it is. Monokuma. Whoa. Yeah, knock back. Okay. I'll break you. I'll break you all. And I am leveling up! Okay, anything on this wall? Anything here? Let's see what Minimaru has to say about this. <laughs> Minimaru is telling us to go that way! Okay, dead body, dead body, door. Let's see what's in here. Okay. Mastering disappointment. Various regrets accompany life. Messing up at, a, at work, rocky relationships. If only I had done things differently. If only I could go back to that day. Have you been looking to the past lately? What you need is to master disappointment. Because you haven't been able to properly attain ultimate disappointment, you will forever be stuck in the past. Acquire the skill of disappointment so that you may finally begin looking for, towards the future. A guidebook to life that shines upon tomorrow. Written by an author who has seen so much of the world. Living in a pharmacy until the age of 10. What's wrong with being disappointed? Tomorrow is for tomorrow's sake. <laughs> I don't really like books like this. I feel like I'm being scolded or something. So... Right Wonder. off the bat, the introduction is pretty fishy. Tomorrow and future and you. I can't believe how often I used to get suckered in by books like this. So you, you, so you do read this kind of stuff, huh? I thought you were all about your literature. Nothing. I mean, in the past, I pursued some when I was, when I was a weaker woman than I am now. Hmm. A weaker Togo? I can't even imagine it. To me, you are always a strong person who never gets depressed. No, I'm not really strong. N not deep down. But if I look strong in your eyes, then I guess that means I've grown a little. I see. Grown, huh? I gotta do that too. You're right. Good idea. You're pretty annoying the way you are right now. Mm -hmm. Wow, you didn't even try to sugarcoat that. Good. But if you want to change, then that's the perfect time to. Or maybe that's that. It's that. At a time like this, you have to change. Hmm? I have to. Imagine being locked inside close space with your classmates and forced to murder them. Whether you want to or not, you change! I can't imagine, but our current situation is just as unbelievable, really. I guess I really do have to change. Just be sure you don't change for the worst. And Toko, that thing you mentioned earlier about killing your classmates. What? Amazing! That sounds like an interesting concept! What a cool setting! You should be a writer! I, I am a writer! Oh my gosh, poor Togo! Even Makoto heard about her! Come on, Togo! Reveal that you are a writer! That was your ultimate skill! You are the ultimate writer! But anyways, let's just keep... Yeah, move on. Okay, let's get out the door. Though some more ammo would be nice. 
Okay, we went that way before. Let's keep going. I'm not seeing the sparkles! I'm not seeing sparkles! Oh, there's a door over there. Okay, I'll go through this door. There's probably a... This door is locked! Well, no use in crying over it. Okay, where there's paint, there's poly gain. I don't know. I'm just checking. This will probably be a shortcut later. This door is locked. Yes, yes, it is. Move, move. More break! Come on! More knockback! Come on! I want break ammo! Okay, we have another Monokuma another machine. Corner here. Oh, that's nice. Thank you. Let's see what this one is. Monokuma! Looks like we can defeat them all in one go. Okay, we're gonna come out there. Okay, my guess is we're gonna have to sneak behind the Monokum. We're gonna turn right left, and then we're gonna knock them back. Okay. Okay. Okay, guy aimed and hopefully this will work. Boom! Did it! Got it! Just don't put me in front of any cars. Oh, I hate those cars. Yeah, and some health that I don't need. But hey, I'm perfectly fine with it. Can I at least pick it up for later? Because I'm probably going to need that health later. Okay, nevertheless, we made it over here. Let's check over, see what this area has. Okay. I'm sorry I'm scanning, I gotta scan it just to make sure. Cause that paint feels suspicious. Okay, we went that way. We're on the other side of the gap. We're gonna be probably coming back down here anyways. You know what? I'm gonna keep that Monokuma machine open because, really, I have man, enough ammo for the moment. What? what? Usa Monami? Looks like we have to help Usami. What is that? Someone's getting ambushed. We gotta go save them. I'll break you, I'll break you, I'll break you. Yeah, that's how you do it. That's how you do it. Okay, come on out, Usami. Okay, let's just rescue Usami, though I don't think Usami's real. Excuse me. Are you alright? What? That weird Monokuma? That it's what? Monokuma? What does this mean? Monokuma's beating up another Monokuma? Maybe it was reprogrammed by the Future Foundation. Maybe to infiltrate. That's surprising. I never figured robots would have internal discord. <sighs> I, I thought I was gonna die. Don't be scared. It's okay. I'm not 
not a particularly suspicious bear. I'm a nice bear. The kind of bear who would give my opponent the corner in Othello. Oh, Maru, what are you doing? Hurry up and shoot this thing! You look like some little Usami yeah. prototype. You'll understand if we just talk it out. Talking things out with a Monokuma never goes well. But I see that the despair eyes covered up. Talk? Why are you even talking in the first place? I have an AI inside me. I'm different than the other Monokumas. AI? Artificial intelligence? It's inside you? That's right. I can think and reason. I won't run amok like those other bears. Oh my gosh, this is kind of creepy though. I mean, I always thought that Monokuma would be shorter, you know? I'm your ally. Look, I'm all white, see? <laughs> I'm a white bear, so I'd like to be called Shirokuma. You know, it's kind of cute. <laughs> Don't be fooled. It's more unnatural if it's all white. It's like a curry plate without the curry. I swear, Toko and Komaru need to be need to be cops who just saw slash detectives who solve cases and bring in criminals. I could just imagine Komaru being the good cop and the Toko being the bad cop. Don't say that. We can be friends. I want to be friends with as many pretty ladies as possible. Though it's kind of reasonable that Toko would be suspicious of a Monokuma, considering that the Monokuma she knows what that she knew well. He wasn't exactly the most outright violent person. He would try to get, he'd try to use his silver words and the like. But, pretty? Hmm. He may look suspicious, but I can see he has a pretty good eye. Toko gets easily fooled too, huh? That's right. I have a good eye for judging character. For example, just by looking at your face, I can guess the time and date of your first kiss. Huh? Oh, what a horrifying function. It's horrifying. Yeah, and then basically, Shirokuma says, analyze the Toko. That time will be never. I mean, if you can tell that about the first kiss, then you should know other first. Toko? Right? It has to actually be possible to happen. If he uses that power, he can mercilessly expose frauds who claim to be virgins. Huh? Girl power is mostly from virginity. This is why so many girls try so hard to be seen as virgins. <laughs> but if we have this one's power, we can uncover the misdeeds of those fraudulent career women. Oh my gosh, run! Run, everyone! There's no mistaking it. This power can change the world! And that is when Toko became an ultimate despair. Uh, I was just giving an example. And what does this have to do with our current situation anyway? I guess you're right. I got a little heated there. By the way, what are you guys doing in a place like this? Fragile girls wandering around a dangerous place like this is a big no-no. But just seeing that voice coming out of a Monokuma. What? Are you going to lecture us now? It's not our fault. We don't know where to go. I see. So you're drifters. Girls driven into a corner with nowhere to run. If that's the case, leave it to me. I can take you to a safe place. Yeah, then we end up back in Hope's Peak. Huh? A safe place? Well, that's quite suspicious. It's something a kidnapper would say. You went through a lot up till now, so you have trouble trusting people. I understand. But the world is also full of amazing people. You don't have to be so pessimistic. Sorry, but words coming out of a Monokuma's mouth aren't exactly persuasive. I don't know. He did convince. He did convince several of your classmates to kill me. To kill their friends. Hey, where is the safe place you're talking about? Full disclosure, there's a secret base here underground where adults are living and hiding. S secret base? Did you hear that, Toko? A secret base with adults gathered there. We should go there too, right? Hey, what do you think? I mean, what should we do? 
e even though it was hard enough to find an exit, you want to keep going through the underground? Uh, but it's dangerous to use those stairs. There are tons of Monokumas lurking around the exit. Huh? See? So wouldn't it be a smarter idea to find the secret base? That doesn't mean this guy's telling the truth. He is a Monokuma, after all. I just want to save you. If you come with me, you can see whether or not I'm telling the truth. You hear that? What do we do? If you think we shouldn't, then I'll go with you. But logically, this is the best option, right? This is the kind of chance that, like, 100 out of 100 people would take. Just be honest and say you want to go. Jeez, you're annoying. Uh, fine. You want me to go? Then I'll go. Yay! We're right. going on an adventure. Let's do that. All right, I'll lead. So follow me. Oh, this is just creepy. I'm yeah. not. I'll leave it to you, Shirakuma. Not in this off until we get to a new next save point. Uh, over there. We gotta go over there. Which way is over there? Jeez, you're a terrible navigator. Let's try to find a save point. I guess over here. It's no good. It's locked. No problem. Leave it to me. Leave it to you? What are you gonna do? Go through the vent and unlock it from the other side. It went inside. And it came out. Ta-da! It's unlocked now. Amazing! That's a pretty convenient body. A convenient body? That's a pretty strange way to put it. Let's go! Okay, any save areas? Anything to pick up? Ammo, please tell me it's ammo. Yay, ammo. Doc back! Why do the children do such terrible things? Should you know you're a Monokuma? Really, where's the save point when you need one? It's I that arcade machine again. Let's get a move on. Okay, come on, give me more ammo. Good, more break. Monaco man. Waka waka. Looks like we have to time it just right. Okay, we're gonna go. We're gonna go left and then just go straight. Okay, let's do this. Knock back. Okay. Wait for them, wait for them. Come on! I swear, every time I miss one Monokuma, one Monokuma. Check out the website for more info. Look at the website for more. Yes, I want to look for more info. Okay, come on. Let's just get out of here. Where every time it's one Monokuma. Amazing, you two sure are strong. Where's a save point? Not me. It's all thanks to this gun. This megaphone. Let's see what Mini Maru has to say. Whoa. That way, that way. Okay, we survived that. Anything down here? Sorry if this episode's going on a little long. I just want to find a save point. 
Okay, I want to choose suicide. This entire land is no good anymore. No matter where I hide, the monocoons will find me sooner or later. I made it into the underground, but it's not like this place is ever going to be safe forever. I remember the bodies, all of them stacked up like debris. I remember them at random times out of nowhere. I see their faces. Will I join them soon? If I'm going to be killed like that, I think I would rather just commit suicide. Just end it, but I'm too scared to choose suicide. I'm scared of dying and then me, my friends in the afterlife, the ones who wanted to live so badly. I feel like suicide would be betraying them. There's no way I can do that. Hmm. You talk big, but you end up being killed by Monokumas, just like the others. Uh, uh, how horrible. What? Hmm. Did, you, did you know this guy or something? No, I have no idea who he is. But a dog killed my children. He didn't do anything wrong. I never get used to seeing it. It's the worst tragedy our society has ever seen. You're a sentimental one. Uh, uh, if only, if only I had more power. If I was stronger, I, I could have prevented this. Um, it's not your fault. It's not your fault, Shirokuma. Come on, cheer up. But thank you. Strange that this guy is already so close with her. Okay. Move it. More batteries. More batteries. Okay. Let's go down this way where the where Mini Maru is pointing us and nail the wall. Your favorite thing, Coco. Let's see if you have anything to say about it. Nope, nothing to say about, of course, being propped up. Go on, Shirokuma. Shirokuma. Go in there, Shirokuma. Oh, not another one! Not another Junk Monokuma! Considering that's what you are! At least I'm comboing it. Oh, at least it died. That was a close one. Ugh, that thing just always creeps me out. I swear, it's like a Five Nights at Freddy's fan creation. Yeah. Why don't we take a break here? Is there at least a save station? Of course. I don't have to take any breaks, but I was being considerate of you ladies. Well, thanks for the thought. You two really are strong. <laughs> I'm glad you aren't my enemies. That has yet to be seen. It's not like I trust you. But I'm really not your enemy. What do I need to do to have you guys trust me? You were suspicious from the start. Awfully convenient to just run into us down here. Were you perhaps waiting for us? It's true that I did coincidentally see you guys go down here, so I came down to wait. <laughs> you see? I knew it! You were waiting for us from the start! But it was just so I could save you. I swear! I was watching you for a bit, and you seemed like you were in trouble, so I wanted to save you. What? Save? We're the ones who saved you, remember? I'm so ashamed. Why did you want to save us? No reason in particular. I just want to save people. That's all. Huh? There's no way I should be the only one keeping his fur white during hard times like this. That's a guy? He's definitely. Even if it is telling the truth, it's still really weird. I mean. Just because it has an AI, why does that make it act different than the other Monokumas? You can ask, but even I'm not sure myself. The only thing I can say is that I have an AI with a personality. A special thought process. Wait, an AI with a thought process? So does this mean that it's an alter ego? I don't know who put this AI in me, or for what purpose. Hey, maybe it was Chibi's... The person that they kept hostage to motivate Chibi to kill first. I don't know. Because we saw Leon's cap, the captive that was used for Leon, we saw the hostage that was used for Leon, we saw the hostage that was used for Taka. We're controlling one of the hostages that was used for Makoto. 
You don't even know that? So perhaps... So perhaps maybe Ch one of Chibi's relatives survived. But it's the same with humans, right? They don't know where they came from and why, right? Knowing that made me feel like I never want to be lost. I have a heart and I'll follow it. That is just weird coming from a Monokuma. It just is. That's amazing. <laughs> you think so? Don't be so impressed by some talking bear. Get a hold of yourself. I can't help it. It's not like I'm special or anything. I'm just a normal girl. I'm getting really tired of hearing that. Now then, now that that's cleared up, it's about time we move along. It's not cleared up at all. See, if we go through there, we can get into the sewer. By going deeper underground, yay. Uh, we're going into the sewer? We're going into Nagito's realm. Yeah. The secret base or worse yet, there. we're going in Nekumaru's domain because it's filled with poop. It's filled with crap. It fills with it's filled with feces. He's gonna rise up from it like some swamp creature. Oh, but the other Monokumas don't know about it. So shh. I've got my eye on you, bear. Oh, come on, no save point. That's mean. Let's go down the ladder. It's dark and smelly. I eat your mind, Toko. Talking about me. I would say something so cool. <laughs> no, you, you would. But anyways, on that note, I think now's a good time to end things off. Oh, a shop. But anyways, I really appreciate that you stuck around to watch this episode. You're a great viewer, and I hope you come back for the next one. So if you like the video, like, subscribe, comment, share to wherever you want. And with that, I will see you later. Bye.